With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. The question is, the given figure shows an isosceles triangle ABC inscribed in a circle such that AB equals to AC. If DAE is a tangent to the circle at point A, prove that DE is parallel to BC. So if we look at the diagram, what we can see? Here we can see that there is a circle. Okay. DA is the tangent at point A and AB, AC are equal of this, uh, of this uh, triangle ABC. So, as these two sides of the triangle are uh, equal, that means we can say that angle ABC will be just angle ACB. Okay. So, we can write in triangle ABC, angle B will be equal to angle C. Why? As angles, angles opposite to, opposite to equal, equal sides are equal are equal it is given that a b equals to a c okay now we can say that angle b equals to angle c okay again we can say that angle d a b equals to angle a c b how because it is the angle between the chord a b and the tangent d a so the angle subtended between the chord and the tangent is equals to the angle subtended by the chord in the alternate angle alternate segment of the circle so we can say that as as d a e tangent tangent and a b chord a b chord therefore angle uh, d a b angle d a b will be equals to angle a c b angle a c b okay why because angle in the because angle in the alternate alternate segment alternate segment okay let me tell you the property again the property is whenever there is an angle between the tangent and the chord the angle between the tangent and the chord that means this angle it will be equals to the angle subtended by the chord that means subtended by the chord a b in the interior alternate segment of the circle that means a b is subtending the angle a c b so this angle will be equals to this one okay but we have proved that angle a c b is equals to angle b angle a c b is equals to angle b how angle a c b and angle a b c are same as we have taken angle a b c as b so we can say that but but angle a c b equals to angle a b c okay now we can see that these are the two lines d a e and b c okay this is the transversal line a b and we have got two interior two interior alternate angles and they are equal that means when these two angles are equal you can say that these two lines are parallel so you can say that as uh, as d a e and and b c has the transversal line as the transversal transversal line what is the transversal line a b and interior 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 alternate angle interior alternate angle angle dab angle dab angle dab equals to angle abc abc we can say that therefore dae dae parallel to bc which implies simply we can uh, we can just remove the a because it's in the middle of the line we can simply say that de parallel to bc this is what we had to prove okay how did you prove that because whenever there is a line whenever there is a transversal line and there are two lines passing by the transversal line makes two interior alternate angles and they are equal then the necessary condition is these two lines will be perpendicular uh, sorry parallel so we can say that de parallel to bc so this is the required solution of this question thank you for class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.